That's an interesting question. There are two Greek words for new. One is genos and the other is neos. The one means fresh, brand new, brand new. The other means renewed. So you don't get anywhere trying to argue that it means one, not the other. It means both. It is a renewal of the covenant which God made with Abraham, but it's also brand new because Messiah is brand new. So we should not be living under the old covenant. That's going to kill you. That's going to put you in prison, in custody. That new covenant is forever, of course. Its Hebrew roots are certainly Hebrew roots. Everything in the Bible is Hebrew roots. It all comes from a very Jewish background, but the new covenant is certainly not only to be called renewed. It's both new and renewed. And the new covenant really is new, brand new. It is not like the covenant made in the old times. Unlike, if you want the best sermon on that, you go to Galatians chapter four, which says the stark difference between the new and the old covenant is the difference between Hagar and Isaac. Vast difference. Totally, one is a bad deal and the other is a good deal. Sarah is your model for the new covenant.